guys, I am back to make just a small, quick batch of black raspberry vanilla salt bars, and I thought I would turn the camera on so you guys could see how I make them. Um, my recipe is 80% coconut oil, and because of that, too much coconut oil can be drying to your skin, so I super fat this at 20%. Um, and I have shea butter in here as well, so I'm going to mix, um, I have 8 ounces of sea salt that I'm going to mix in there, and my fragrance, and I'm going to put a little bit of this uh, Voodoo Mica in there, and I'm going to use this mold, and I measured it so that it would fill this mold and this mold, but after I looked at it, I'm like, man, that doesn't look like very much oil. So I don't know if I'll have enough to fill this. I like to do these. These are this is like a little brownie bite silicone. It's a it's from Wilton, and they make really cute little squares. And I put them in um, little bags or whatever and sell them that way. And people love them. So if I have enough, I'm gonna fill these. Otherwise, I'm gonna start with the bigger flower flower ones and we'll see. I've not done it in these molds before. That's why I had to recalculate my recipe. So I'm not new. Let's go ahead and get started. It seems so weird making just this tiny batch. I'm going to go ahead and add my fragrance now. and just add, I don't want these to be very dark, so I'm just going to add a little bit and see what it looks like. That's pretty, but I want to look a little bit more. I feel like my soap room, I feel like it's closing in on me. I have stuff everywhere and it just, it's like, it gives me anxiety so bad, but, um, I've got just so much going on right now and I've got so much soap to wrap and we have not even started packing. So I am just stressed. So I'm just making soap so I don't have to think about it. Um, if you've never had a salt bar, they're very, it's very spa-like, it's very, um, it's exfoliating, it just feels really nice on your skin. Um, I would definitely recommend trying one if you haven't. Now let's see how my calculations were as far as these molds go. I'm going to give this a quick stick blend and then I'll just pour them into the mold. some um, requests um, for sugars to make some um, sugar scrub and so I think I'll do that probably on camera to show you guys um, I don't know if it's everywhere but in some of the nice restaurants here I had to put this towel over because this cookie sheet did not look very good um, in the rest some of the nicer restaurants down here they have this bowl that sits by in the restroom by the sink and it has a little scoop in it and you scoop it just a little bit and put it on your hands and it's got sugar in it 
and they're very moisturizing. You le your hands feel like satin when you're finished. So people that come here, they've asked about that. A friend told me that works at the store that I sell at, so I think I might start making those. Um, okay, so far so good. I still have extra, if I calculated this right, I'm going to be very impressed with myself. everyone welcome back I just wanted to show you how the salt bars came out that's one of the flowers there's three different styles I thought they turned out really cute and then these are the little squares that it made I'm gonna make more of these um, in different and probably the more popular fragrances and just they have to cure four to six weeks just because they are cold process soap so they still have to cure but i just wanted to show you how they turned out they came out of the molds really easy it's been about 18 hours or so so thanks for watching and i'll see you on the next video